What is the scariest fact you know? I live near the beach, around one and a half kilometers away as the crow flies. At night it's peaceful outside, most nights not hearing a thing but the occasional bird or car. It's also quite dark, seeing nothing but a single street light in the stars. However sometimes it's possible to hear the waves crashing against the rocks even when the house is shut. Every so often I think about how loud those waves can be and imagine a tidal wave rushing in. No warning, just the sound of a crashing wave getting louder and louder until I realize, that's too close to be crashing on the beach. How prevalent cannibalism was in the US until the civil rights movement. How African Americans are still often treated inhumanely whilst there was a NIF cookbook that instructed how to cook human flesh. But yeah, let's not teach history BC, poop, like this might show why people of a certain age don't like those with pigment. The book is called The Delectable. Not that word, but the one that is also in and not acceptable. Also, eating mummies is obviously freaky. TF was going with all these white people? At some point in the future, the world's ability to provide clean healthy food to humans will be so detrimentally diminished that famine will be the ultimate tool in war. Loss of food in an area where food is common is the first step to uncontrollable violence. The only part of this I don't know, is whether clean healthy water will also be diminished before or after that fact. Water is much easier to provide than food. About 14 of people are gathered by somebody other than the person they believe their dad is. And that holds consistent across all races, religious, ethnicities, etc. Learn this during a semester in a genetic counseling clinic. Turns out non-paternity comes up a ton as an incidental finding when kids get genetic testing for stuff. We had a long discussion about how it's handled in my ethical issues in genetics class. There's a subgenre of child porn called hardcore where the viewers prefer it if the kids are crying, screaming, actively trying to fight their attacker off, bleeding, being choked, or tied up. Somewhere out there, there's a 40 second video my assailant took of me when he raped me and a cop once let it slip in front of me that it does numbers on the dark net. Your eyes are not part of your immune system? So if the immune system discovers them, they will destroy them and you will go blind. Another fact, just for the fun of it. Your body can create an allergy at any given moment. You might wake up one day and explode your toilet because your body now thinks you can't eat dairy anymore. Currently in Japan, another nuclear power plant is in trouble due to the New Year's Day earthquake and its power supplies broken nuclear plants need their own supply. Fortunately, the damage is not severe and the plan has been stopped for more than a decade, so even in the worst case scenario it's not catastrophic. That they were dumping millions of barrels of DDT and industrial waste, into the ocean right off the coast of California, from the 1930s to the 1970s. Now most of those barrels are rusted and leaking their contents into the ocean. People still eat the fish they catch and swim surf in that water. You could die or wink out of existence without warning. The entire universe or local region could be destroyed in some physical cataclysm, and it is likely that it will happen without warning or any ability to predict it. Literally. Click. Any millisecond of any day. Just like that. A very large number of near-Earth objects are too small dark to be detected, and even if we were able to detect them in advance we might not even be able to do anything about it with current technology. Suffice it to say they've done the math old boy, and it doesn't look good. That most of the people here will never own a house and anyone that is below the age of 30 present time will most likely not retire for at least another 35 years minimum. I plan on beating the odds. I want to retire by age 40 currently age 28 and 7 months will be age 29. Piranha solution can completely dissolve any organic matter in minutes. Any organic matter? And it dissolve isn't actually the right word to use here. It literally violently converts any organic matter anything primarily carbon and hydrogen into CO2 and water. You can be sitting talking to a friend or a loved one and suddenly die from a burst brain aneurysm. Most likely source of blood exiting your body is the ears, followed by the nose, eyes, and mouth. I miss my uncle now that I've brought this up. Split brain patients suggest every one of us has a secondary consciousness inside of us that sits there silently but still has control over your body and actions. CGP graded a video on it. If you die alone in a house with a dog, it will go hungry for several days and then eventually start eating your arms and legs. If you die alone in a house with a cat, it will go hungry for one day, and then start by eating your face. There's a strain of bacteria I can't remember which one for sure. Maybe Klebsiella pneumoniae that's only susceptible to one antibiotic, as Trianem. If it develops resistance to that, yeah, 
that's gonna cause problems. The climate change we notice now is a result from the pollution we produced a decade ago. Even if we could, for some magical reason, stop it globally right away. The effects will still go on for years. When a star explodes it releases a gamma burst that destroys everything in its path, if one goes off near Earth it'll lead to extinction and Therese no warning because it happens immediately. By the time you have a symptom for rabies you're already dead. You'll start getting paranoid and afraid and die alone and thirsty and terrified as your brain dissolves inside your skull. That even if you think you have a lot friends, when you die only a few people will care not personal OFC. There was a guy in Romania who did this experiment, and found this out. 95 of people who surrender their entire lives to Jesus do so before the age of 25. The odds of people making that decision later and later in life become much more difficult. A cure for AIDS was made by a bunch of scientists. Said scientists all hopped on a plane to announce their success. The plane was shot down and their research disappeared. There are billions of people in religions that think that other religions or people that are not religious are wrong. This will cause a lot of problems in coming years. That the big one is bound to happen anytime soon, but there's no telling when, and it will have devastating effects to life, limb, and property. At a big earthquake, we live within a few miles of gas, atop floating rocks, in the expansive vacuum of unforgiving space, quite literally a stone's throw from complete and total annihilation. Americans microwave water to make cups of tea and will fight to the death that it is not in any way dangerous despite the overwhelming wealth of evidence to the contrary. So many personal stories from occupied territories, especially from people of Mari Ubal. How people were buried alive, tortures, rapes that lasted for weeks etc. Trump is going to win the presidency again in 2024 because Biden sucks. Young people will stay home and the DNC has their collective head shoved up its ass. Space is constantly expanding. This means that one day, no matter how little light pollution there is, you won't be able to see stars in the night sky. We have more detailed and plotted maps of our moon and of Mars than we do of our own oceans as we've only mapped roughly 5 of the ocean floor. There is over 150 dead hiker body buried under the snow of Mount Everest. Most of those his body are almost intact. The cold prevent the decay. If a nuclear war were to happen in the UK, precious artwork would take precedence over the wider populace and be moved to a nuclear bunker. Polly that there's actual date and time on which I die? Like not exist at all. Can't actually get my head over the fact of not existing. In hell, skins of people will be replaced with other skins when the hellfire burn the previous one so they can get the punishment again. You probably know this one John Edward Jones body is still in the nutty putty cave to this day. His body is forever upside down. I turn 66 soon. Looking back at 40 it doesn't seem that long ago at all. If I live to 90 I will only have 244 months left to live. There's a giant volcano under Yellowstone National Park and if it erupts it could wipe out a huge chunk of the global population. That pedo rings are just the tip of the iceberg of human perversion. Most people cannot fathom how deep some shitholes go. That this world is run by stupidity and not logic. Humans are literally too stupid to realize that. Just look at society. That Tiamat can throw those who stand against him into the den of vipers of torments. All hail Tiamat in his greatness. Each and every person you love including yourself is going to suffer and die and there's nothing you can do about it. Most men don't believe women are fully human with dreams and desires of their own that have nothing to do with men. We could be living in a part of reality that is slowly being torn apart by a black hole and we would never know. I mean. Probably the fact that there's a super volcano underneath Yellowstone that's way overdue for an eruption. There's zero anonymity online, only amount of effort to track you down and that's constantly getting easier. You can appear very healthy, catch a bug, and be dead three days later. Nothing you can do about it. Bad luck. There are microscopic organisms living in your pores which emerge at night to have sex in your face. All the progress we've made in the last 200 years will be wiped out within the next few centuries. When dogs go deaf, they don't understand. They think that you have just stopped talking to them. If you stare at a mirror with a dim light for around 10 minutes, you will see ghostly things. Death can come at any second from any number of things, often without warning or time to react. When typically blows east, when it doesn't. There might be a tornado or hurricane on the rise. No one is in charge. All these men in suits are just as much as a dumbass as everyone else. Does anybody know why this question gets asked here about every three days like clockwork? Take the average stupid person and you realize that half of the others are even stupider. Chainsaws were originally made for childbirth. I'm not kidding look it up if you wish to. That the same five facts will be repeated on this weekly question. 
The cycle continues. Kisi Kisum acquired a nuclear device before he died and it remains unaccounted for. We are all going to die. It's probably going to hurt and we won't be ready for it. There's a different version of you in the minds of every person you've ever met. There are gases inside you right now. If mixed, you would explode immediately. That every Reddit question has been asked and answered multiple times before. If a bear attacks it won't kill you immediately. It'll just start eating. Time is unstoppable and you only live every second of your life for once. Most of celebrities that we know and love had visits to Jeffrey Island. Every year you pass the anniversary of what will be your own death day. George Lopez is just out untethered. Unrestrained. That Diaper Dawn has a better than even chance of being elected again. That this question gets asked 5x day every fucking day to farm karma. It takes about 5 pounds of force to tear a human ear off their skull. Winter comes every year. Scares the shit out of me every year too. Bacterial meningitis can cause death in as little as a few hours. That every good or bad thing you do, is going to get back to you. The sun could have exploded 8 minutes ago, and we wouldn't know. Once your immune system knows you have eyes, boom. You're blind. That this question will get posted again next week without fail. The best people you ever knew and who meant the most are dead. Climate change is real and I might live to see it destroy us. Almost every surface. Anywhere is covered in fecal bacteria. 99 of people are closer to homelessness than housing secure. There are over 250,000 deaths a year due to medical error. The only thing that is truly inevitable in life is death. One day I was simply born, and then all of this happened. Inside each and every one of us lives a spooky skeleton.